I did not mean to copy my bed. The bed copied me. We are not the same. Today, we are watching The Hunchback of Notre Dame. Yeah, I've not really got much else to say. Subscribe and leave a like, because I need to know if you enjoy this video. And if you don't, then I won't straighten this umbrella. I'll do it. As usual, my social media links will be in the description down below, as well as my Patreon account, where you can watch the full length commentary to this. And let's just, let's just get right into it. There's just something about bells that are so mysterious. Like, I don't know if it's the Notre Dame bells or just bells in general, but they're mysterious. Bells of Notre Dame. I like your voice, dude. Oh, goodness, for safe passage into Paris. A contract had been laid. Safe passage, you say, where your services were crap. And sin. Why does that horse look evil? And like, all Disney horses are good. Why do you look evil? Garrett, no, I'm not having it. Guaranteed by the end of this movie, the horse will be good. See, look at his innocent face. There's no way it's evil. A monster. Have you seen yourself? You're not that good looking either, pal. Innocent blood you have spilled on the steps of Notre Dame. Wait, she's dead? How is she dead? Like, don't get me wrong, they look like a strong kick, but I thought she would only get like a severe concussion or something. Not death. Now, what the hell are these statues doing? I know they're made of rock, but they're staring right into my soul. I generally feel violated. Care for the child and raise it as your own. What? Aha, you a father now, bitch! And Frollo gave the child a cruel name. A name that means half form. Ozimodo. How sick can you get? Let me look this up. No, I'm not saying I don't believe him. I definitely do believe him. I just want to know where the origin of this word or name came from. Like, there must be more. To, like, surely you're not that cruel. Ozimodo, noun, low Sunday to the ugly humpback protagonist of the Hunchback of Notre Dame. Well, that's just a bit rude. Like, this is from the actual dictionary. Literally, the dictionary. The dictionary definition of Quasimodo is the ugly. Why the ugly? The ugly humpbacked protagonist of the Notre Dame. Hunchback of Notre Dame. Dictionary, I expected better from you. Who is the monster and who is the man? I mean, the real monster is the, the old guy. Like, he was about to kill a baby, a baby, that with no threat. I'm pretty sure we can tell who the monster is. Bells, 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 bells. Oh, this guy's voice is great. There was something about the way he was saying bells is just pure poetry. Like, keep saying bells repeatedly. I'm all for it. If I picked a day to fly, oh, this would be it. The Festival of Fools. Yeah, could you want to get your ass out of there? <laughs> Uh -huh. So like all statues alive in Notre Dame, or is it just his imagination? Pageantry. This man could be a toy maker. Like I bet he loves ringing bells. Like I, I would too, especially if it's Notre Dame. But the man has talent for making toys. He really could be a toy maker. Life's not a spectator sport. If watching is all you're gonna do, then you're gonna watch your life go by without you. There's a Disney quote right there. <laughs> Good quote. You're right. I'll go. Yeah, oh, hurrah. I'll get cleaned up. Yes. I'll march through the doors and... Good morning, Quasimodo. <laughs> no, you ain't. <laughs> Can Stone talk? Yes, because you're talking. <laughs> Festival. <laughs> Excuse me. F forgiveness. You said festival. No! He said the F word. You don't say that. I didn't mean to upset you, Master. Does he know that's not his father? Like, he keeps calling him Master. Like, surely if it was his father, he'd, he'd call him Father or Dad or Daddy. But he calls him Master. So, has he told him? 
helpless mother abandoned you as a child, anyone else would have drowned you. No, sorry, he just lied to him. Form. I am deformed. And you are ugly. And I am ugly. And what the frick? Imagine saying that to someone and not feeling sorry or pity. Like, yes, it's good to tell the truth. Yes, he's not perfect, but nobody's perfect. We all have our different characteristics. Like, I have two different coloured eyes. I have one pupil that's bigger than the other. I'm far from perfect, but it's our flaws and uniqueness that make us beautiful. You bet your ass I'm adding that to the Welchie quotes. <laughs> All my life I watched them as I hide up here alone. I'm very surprised at how much of a musical this movie is so far. Like, everybody just sings. Like, even when they're talking, they're talking singing. What I give. Like, you can sing! Wait, wait, wait. Is that who I think it is? That's so bell. Don't think I, I'm the god at cameos. I can spot them from a mile away. That's a 100% bell from Beauty and the Beast. Like, nobody else dresses like that and reads a book in the middle of a town. Oh, that passion alone. He, see if he doesn't spend one day out there. This movie's over. Why is that animal cooler than me? That's just not fair. Where'd you get the money? For your information, I earned it. Gypsies don't earn money. It's called busking. It's where you show off your incredible talent on the streets and people reward you for it. Get with the times. Oh, come on. Don't do that to a guy's moustache. Like, he's been going that for, what, like, five years, probably? Have respect for the stash. Is this a real place? Like, or is this just made for movie purposes? Because it looks sick if it is a real place. My last captain of the guard was, um... Well, no matter. I'm sure you'll whip my men into shape. Ha <laughs> ha, did you get it whip? Because you whipped the old captain. Ha <laughs> ha, clever. I have been taking care of the gypsies. What did the ants do to you? Every day. Oh, he so knows who he is, doesn't he? Here, let's see. No, no, no! There. See? No harm done. I like you. I like you. Great mask. Oh, come on. Oh, my God. The, dis the disrespect. Not like you didn't mean to disrespect him, but the disrespect from a third person perspective. Oh. <laughs> He's in love. <laughs> the face that's ugliest will be the king of fools. Get your shame Oh no, man. Ah! No! Hideous. I don't like it. Stop. Oh, no, I'm, I'm gonna stop. <laughs> The king of being ugly, really? Oh wait, he's happy! Oh! Okay, mate, if you don't mind being the king of ugly then, I'm happy for you. What? What, he's got tomato juice on him? That doesn't make him more ugly. He's not even ugly! Ah, uh, bitch, 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 and the guy that started it, major bitch. Yeah, see, he could be all your asses. All of you are window lickers. Twat. The mayor of bitch. I'm sorry, this wasn't supposed to happen. I like you. Again. Yet you are cruel to those most in need of your help. Silence! Justice! Oh, she is the arm in the air. Oh, that's when you know it's serious. The only fool I see is you. Is you! Ha <laughs> ha, yeah! <laughs> Witchcraft. <laughs> to be fair, is he wrong? <laughs> How the hell did you do that? <laughs> Rest in peace. Rest in peace. <laughs> you are going. You two are going to get your asses whipped. <laughs> oh, my earphones have died. Don't you just love when you forget to charge your wireless earphones? I love it.
back to wired we go. This has been a really sad movie so far. I am even going to lie to you. <laughs> Touché. Oh. Do you think I would look like him if I grew my hair out? Should I do it? I might do it, you know. Claimed sanctuary. I'm sorry, sir. She claimed sanctuary. To Frollo learned years ago, respect the sanctity of the church. <laughs> he owns you. <laughs> what are you doing? I was just imagining a rope. No, you weren't. You were sniffing her hair. I mean, it looks like nice hair, but that's a bit weird, pal. Well, no one out there is going to help, that's for sure. Perhaps there's someone in here who can. Quasi Modo, the man of the hour. I don't know if you can hear me. Ooh. It's the voice of an angel. I ask for God and his angels. I love a stained glass. Like stained glass can tell such a brilliant story. I'd love to go to Notre Dame. Children Today wasn't a total loss after all. A vision of loveliness. The one in the dress ain't bad either. <laughs> what is this place? This is where I live. Did you make all these things yourself? Follow me. I'll introduce you. I bet he names his bells. Jean Marie, Anne Marie, Louise Marie. Triplets, you know. Told you. Yep. Every bell has a name. I am a monster, you know. He told you that? Look at me. Give me your hand. Why? I don't see any. Any what? Monster lines. <laughs> oh, I really like her. Ready? Yes. Don't be afraid. I'm not afraid. Now I'm <laughs> Is this where they got the inspiration for Assassin's Creed? I'll come after sunset. And I ring the vespers and whatever's good for you. <laughs> when you wear this woven band, you hold the city in your hand. Don't you need a key to hold the city in your hand? Maybe the woven band is a key. Hey, he's a nice guy. Good captain. Esmeralda, she's very lucky. Why? To have a friend like you. <laughs> you cheesy captain. I'm all for it. Snooping around here trying to steal your girl. My girl? Esmeralda. He's actually getting more action than me. It's just, uh, my, my, my life's a tragedy. <laughs> no face as hideous as my face. <sighs> it's just, it's really, it's, uh, this movie is actually very depressing. I'm not gonna lie, I am such a sucker for scenes like this. Carta Maria, you know I'm so much pure. You I actually know this song. Vulgar. I actually know this song. I I forgot or didn't know it was in this movie. How, how's it go? It goes a. Uh... Oh, I can't remember what it's called. We'll get in. <laughs> This is so cool seeing this song in actual life. Like I've only heard it, I don't know the scene behind it. I did not know it was him that sang it. What? This fire in my skin. This is so much more dark than I thought it would be. I genuinely think he's got a crush on Esmeralda. That is so messed up. He I, he definitely loves her. He, oh my God. What? As a kid, I can imagine that this is just an evil song. But as an adult, I know exactly what he means. Basically, he loves her and wants to do things with her. And... If he's not allowed that, he basically just wants to kill her. Is this Disney? <laughs> Is mine or you will burn. This is so dark. I actually cannot believe I'm watching another children's movie. 
What an absolute psycho. I had a little trouble with the fireplace. I see. Yeah, all that singing about loving and wanting to burn Esmeralda really tired me out. Thank you for asking. But we are innocent. I assure you we know nothing of these gypsies. Yeah, see what I mean? Not everybody knows where everybody is at all times. Burn it. What? Yo, this guy's actually lost his mind. He's my captain. My captain forever captain. I'm not joking, he may be the most darkest evil Disney character I've ever seen. Like, his intentions are disgusting, he has no remorse, he will literally burn people and the city of Paris to the ground for a girl who doesn't love him. It's honestly so dark, it's quite scary. Find the girl! If you have to burn the city to the ground, so be it. He's actually so thirsty. I've never seen a man so thirsty before. He does not take rejection well, does he? <laughs> Joe, this movie's quite cool, you know. <laughs> it's so epic. Oh, it's a lost cause! <laughs> she could be anywhere! A guy like you. She's never known kid. And since you're shaped like a croissante. <laughs> God's sake. Not bad, not bad. Not my favourite song. Far from it. But, not bad. He was already prepared, he knew. Oh wait, wait, he wasn't prepared for an injury, he was prepared for him and her to do the you know what. Oh. You're either the single bravest soldier I've ever seen, or the craziest. Ex-soldier, remember? You're my captain. Always will be. Almost pierced your heart. I'm not so sure it didn't. It's so bad, it's good. <laughs> I mean, his heart ain't pierced, but I think you just pierced another heart. My man. See, if I was gay, I would... What? <laughs> Careful, my friend. Promise you won't let anything happen to him. Promise. You've officially been friend-zoned. Wait, when's he ever going to get some good luck? Like, we're, we're an hour in now. Give the man something. There's something troubling you, Quasimodo? Oh, no! Oh, but there is. Yeah, you got crap grapes. You only eat green ones. Green ones are the best. I'm not having it. You helped her escape! But I know all Paris is burning! Think of your mother! Yeah, tell them. And how you killed her! I know where her hideout is, and tomorrow at dawn, I attack. Nah mate, nah. It took you 20 years and you've still not found it, so I doubt you found it now. Trollo was right about everything. I'm tired of trying to be something that I'm not. Do I have monster lines? Like, can you see this? Do I have, any, do I have monster lines? What are my lines like? I think I've got quite good lines. Phoebus, uh, what? I'm coming with you. Glad you changed your mind. Oh! I'm doing it for you. Every time, I'm sick of it. You know where? Here's the cathedral and the river and and, and this little stone. I've never seen a map that looks look. like. Oh my! So basically, it is a key. Well, it's a map that will lead you to the key. Or well, we could just uh, go down those stairs. Is this the court of miracles? The only miracle I'm seeing is death. Like hopefully they're bad people death. Okay, there, there actually must be something wrong with this guy. He's actually lost his mind. Any last words? That's what they all say. <laughs> Funny. Soldier who saved the Miller's family, and Quasimodo helped me escape the cathedral. Nor would I. Oh, oh, he's actually quite smart. He followed them. Hey. Even if you're an evil 
dark, twisted man. Good plan. There'll be a little bonfire in the square tomorrow. Can we have marshmallows? Marshmallows are great. Choose me for the fire. Oh, you're a pedo! Spit on his face. I'd do it again. These chains aren't what's holding you back, Quasimodo. Leave me alone. To be fair, they look like some thick ass chains. <laughs> he looks like a superhero. Oh, this is so epic. The, the music, the animation, the darkness. <laughs> he sanctuary Jurass. What now, bitch? He has declared war on Notre Dame herself. Kelly, sit. Oh, please, poo. Please, poo. Look at this show. This movie is amazing. Yo, what? Is she actually oh, dead? No. If she's dead, I refuse to believe this is a Disney movie. Usually with a Disney movie, I'm like, oh yeah, they might, they're dead for like a couple minutes and then they'll come back. But with this movie, yo, she actually might be dead. Trouble as it was, I hope you can forgive me. With that hairline, absolutely not. <laughs> <laughs> do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. The only thing dark and cruel about it is people like you, Esmeralda. I've known you'd risk your life to save that gypsy witch, just as your own mother died trying to save you. What? Oh my god. This movie's mental. <laughs> oh my god. Let go! No, no, not, don't, you, don't you let go. See, this is why you don't mess with Notre Dame. She will come and kill your ass. And he's the best wingman ever. We all need a Quasimodo in our life. See, kids don't judge people when they're younger. Nobody's born to be judged. You learn it. I'm happy the kid did that. What makes a monster and what makes a man? Oh, it's so sick! <laughs> I'm not going to lie, that's easily one of my favourite Disney movies I've done so far. Just with the whole message and how... How... Uh, I don't mean this in a bad way. Un, how unlike Disney it was. It was so dark that it was great. And I loved at the end there when he said, What is the monster and what is the man? And the monster was Frollo. Because at the start, we think that the monster is Quasimodo because of the way he looks but instead it's actually Frollo because of his intentions and pure darkness like it was it's such a good message that was it for this movie commentary though I hope you all did enjoy and let me know your thoughts on this movie and if you prefer the dark theme that it had because I, I personally really did I wish they did more movies like this I hope you all have a wonderful day and night wherever you are in the world and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye!